is the type of envelope we're going to make out of this Faraday fabric and Faraday tape. It will allow us to wrap a beaker, 50 milliliter or even a 100 milliliter beaker on the inside of it. If you want to do a larger beaker, like 250 milliliters, you'll have to make your envelope a little bit bigger. This one that I'm going to make, I'm going to cut out of Faraday fabric. I'm going to measure it to be about 12 by 7 inches and cut out a rectangle of that size. Okay, gonna take that rectangle now, fold it back on itself, and loop over the other edge to make a seam. a piece of Faraday fabric tape to seal it up. Like that. And uh, do the same along the bottom part. So here I'm going to fold back the bottom edge so there's a completely enclosed surface of fabric around the pocket that we're making on the inside. And here again, I'm taking some Faraday fabric tape, running it along the edge. Trying to seat that right up against the edge there. There we go. Flatten that out. Fold it back over the edges. And that little bit of uh, exposed edge there is something I, I want to try to avoid. So I'm going to use a little bit more Fer Faraday fabric tape to cover that up. Anywhere you see rough edges exposed, you'll want to seal those up. So now I have a pocket that I can uh, put a beaker in. It's almost ready to go for the microwave. Uh, the one thing that's still missing is I'll want to uh, seal up the edge of it. So once I put a container of water in here, let's say, uh, I'll still need to run another bead of tape over the edge. So I'm going to do that. Here I'll cut a full piece of tape rather than the half pieces I have been using to demonstrate that. Again, this is Faraday fabric tape, special metal tape. That should be part of your kit. And along the edge there, what I'm going to want to have ready is a sealable piece of tape right, that can be closed up when I put the uh, container in it. Like this. And then I can fold back around. Again, from the other direction. Put it slided in. It can be folded back around and sealed up. Here we go. That's ready to test in the microwave. Of course, you'll want to make sure that you. And your test is designed around whatever containers the kids suggest um, need to be wrapped, whether it's this microwave safe plastic or Pyrex beaker. And you'll want to make sure ahead of time that the sizes you provide for this experiment fit within your envelopes. But do make some of the, a few of these envelopes pre-made. Um, so putting them into the microwave is a quick process. To show one other thing here, this envelope can now be reused and can be can take measurements of whatever we put inside of it. Let's say it's water in this container. We can pull it out, uh, take temperature measurement uh, using our, our thermometer of whatever substances are in the inside of this water, cheese, or whatever you test. And now the envelope can be reused.